Did you guys saw One Piece live action trailer? Cause I did and I am quite surprised with the trailer because the trailer actually looks quite good. And I know I made a video before saying that I'm not looking forward to One Piece live action because like, come on, a lot of live action is not good. Okay, so I love One Piece so much and I'm not looking forward to live action because based on history, live action just not good. So I'm not looking forward to it. But then I saw the trailer a few days ago and it actually looks quite good. I'm surprised. And please, Zoro is so hot. Like why is he so hot? Like. Like, come on, Zoro is so hot. The moment Zoro came out, I'm like, oh, hot. I mean, he, he got, he's tied up in that pole, wearing Zoro's clothes, green hair, three earrings, and his shirt is open in the middle. I'm like, mm, oh, I am looking respectfully, sir. Mm -hmm. And his skin look tan and glistening, I'm like, Excuse me, that is a, that, that looks hot and look, yeah, very nice to look at. Mm -hmm. And then Sanji, Sanji looks good. Yeah, I mean, I, like Sanji and Zoro actor looks like Sanji and Zoro from the anime and the manga. Like, like hot. Both Sanji and Zoro is so hot. And Z Sanji actor really look like Sanji. I mean, they don't give Sanji the curly eyebrow, but I think they made a good decision not to give Sanji a curly eyebrow because it look more real, not so fake. Yeah. So Sanji looks good. And do they have to do the swimming scene like that? I mean, I don't remember Sanji taking off his clothes in the anime and in the manga when he dives into the water to save his crew. Mm-hmm. But he take off his clothes in the live action and my my eyes was blessed. Yeah. Excuse me. Okay, I'm just an ordinary woman. If I saw something handsome and something that looks hot, I have to say mm hmm I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one sipping over Zoro and Sanji right now. I saw the Twitter. Okay, there are a lot of people saying Sanji and Zoro looks hot. And yes, they do look hot. Mm -hmm. And Usopp, Usopp, Usopp looks good. Yeah, like Usopp actor really look like Usopp even though they don't give the long nose, which I like actually because if they give the long nose, I think it look very prosthetic and looks so fake. I don't think Usopp having long nose is good. Him having normal nose looks good. And yeah, he really look like Usopp. I'm surprised with it. Like, wow, that's like when I saw him, like, wow, that's Usopp. That's really Usopp. And then Nami also looks good. The orange hair, the clothes, she really looks like Nami. I mean, Sanji, Soro, Nami, Usopp, they really look like the One Piece character. Yeah, they really make a good casting. And then there is Shanks. I mean, we only see Shang's back of the head from the trailer, but I mean, just looking at Shang's head from the back, I'm just excited. Like, oh, Shang! And then the Seeking CGI looks good. Yeah, the Seeking CGI doesn't look. I mean, it it kind of look real, or is it just me? But the CGI for the Seeking looks good. Uh huh. And then there's the buggy. Buggy looks horrifying, yeah, he, I mean, in the anime, Buggy doesn't look that horrifying, but Buggy looks horrifying in the live action, I mean, the makeup, the red nose, the zoom in, oh goodness me, Buggy look horrifying, but I think the fact that he looks so horrifying, but he looks, but then he's actually stupid, I think that's gonna, that's going to be really funny, and Kobe is there as well, Kobe looks cute. <laughs> I mean, Kobe just appeared for a few seconds, but Kobe looks cute. And we ha I have to talk about Luffy. Of course, I have to talk about Luffy. 
Luffy is my favorite. Okay, I'm wearing red today because of Luffy. I mean, Luffy always wears red, so I thought I'm going to talk about One Piece live action trailer today. Let me wear red. Yeah. But yeah, Luffy is my favorite, and for me, Luffy is extremely cute. I love Luffy so much because he's so cute. And Luffy is the, the short one, the young, happy-go-lucky, dumb guy, while his crew is the serious and the tall one. And then I also love when Luffy is all serious, fighting the enemies and saving his nakama. And him not giving up to become the king of Paris even when he meets stronger opponents he doesn't give up and he just gets stronger and he's one and he just get closer and closer to his um, dream to be the king of the pirates he really won that adventure and i love luffy and please luffy is so cute i said it i'm gonna i'm gonna say it again luffy is so cute okay especially in the vega punk arc where he's wearing that dress cute very cute. So in my mind, Luffy is just extremely cute. And I saw Luffy's stage actor from Universal Studio Japan. And he, that's like totally Luffy. If you guys haven't seen it, just YouTube, just um, search on YouTube. Universal Studio Japan, Luffy stage actor. I've seen that stage actor since years ago. So every time I think about Luffy as a live actor, I always think about Luffy stage actor. But of course, Luffy live action actor is different from Luffy Universal Studio Japan stage actor. Yeah, oh by the way, I'm showing you guys the pictures. But I um, apologize for... I apologize if a Luffy stage actor kind of blurry because it's a screenshot. Yeah, I did my best. So all this time, Luffy in my mind is Universal Studio Japan Luffy stage actor. And that Luffy looks so similar to Luffy from anime and manga. But of course, Luffy live action actor is totally different. And it's not weird because Oda Sensei always said that Luffy is Brazilian. And Luffy actor definitely looked that part, but I'm not used to it. Yeah, like I need sometimes to get used to Luffy live action actor because all this time the Luffy in my mind is Luffy stage actor from USJ. But it should be, I mean, I cannot say anything further because I haven't watched the TV series and I'm sure Oda Sensei and the production team choose uh, that actor because he really suits Luffy and after all Oda Sensei is the creator. So maybe Oda Sensei always wants Luffy to look like that. But Luffy doesn't look like that in the drawing and in the anime. So yeah, I'm just not used to it. But I like his Hawaiian shirt. It's cute. Yeah. And lastly, I need to talk about the CGI for the Gomu Gomu. I don't like the Gomu Gomu CGI, the gum gum. And it's so weird to hear, hear him say gum gum because all this time I always watch One Piece in Japanese dub. So it's always Gomu Gomu. And it's gum gum. And then the CGI of the stretching arm, it just looks so fake. I mean, of course, it's fake. Human body cannot stretch their body like that. But it looks so fake. And I don't like it. I think they can do better. But the stretching arm part, the gum gum part, I don't like it. And yeah, it's just so weird to hear them talking in English. Okay, because all this time I watched One Piece, the Japanese dub version. I never watched the English dub version. The English is so foreign to my ears. Usually, yeah, like... I always associate the characters with their Japanese voice, so I need to get used to it, yeah. But yeah, I'm actually kind of looking forward to... Uh, sorry, it's hot, so let me fan myself with a chopper fan. But yeah, I'm actually surprised with the trailer. It actually looks good. And of course, even before when I say I'm not looking forward to live action, I'm still going to watch it because I love One Piece. And I need to know if it's good or not. But after watching the trailer... I have high hopes, for, maybe not high hopes, medium hope, <laughs> that it will look good. And Oda Sensei does help with the production. Uh, so hopefully it's good. Yeah. I'm really looking forward to how Arlong, will Arlong, uh, should be, Arlong should be there. How will Arlong look like? After all, he's a fisherman and his nose is jagged like this. So I'm look yeah, 
I'm looking forward to the makeup and the, and how the actors will look like. Because all this time, I think the most unsuitable live action from an anime is One Piece. Because there are a lot of weird um, characters there. And their um, ability is so weird as well. But turns out One Piece is the one that get live action. <laughs> so yeah. Anyway, before I end this video, question for you guys who watched this video. What do you guys think about the trailer? Are you guys looking forward to the live action? Or maybe after watching the trailer, you're still like, nah. Mm -mm. No, I'm not going to watch it. I'm looking forward to it. And what do you guys think about the character and the actors? Do you think the actor suits the character? Or maybe you think someone else suits the character mo more? Yeah, what do you guys think about it? Comment down below. Okay, so yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.